Hey there, Missy here from Upward Spiral Center, and we're always looking for ways to create positive change in our life and essentially inspire an upward spiral. And so one idea that we've been thinking about this month is how to move out of the realm of routine when it comes to our daily tasks and into the realm of ritual. And what does that mean? What is the difference between a routine and a ritual? And for me, the main difference is, is with a routine, I'm not as engaged. I'm usually motivated by external forces and life is more of a chore rather than something that I enjoy. But if I insert some meaningful actions into my daily tasks, I can give those tasks a greater meaning and have a wider perspective of contributing to my health, my success, and my happiness. And what happens is with these small actions, which can be a part of the, the ritual of the activity, I become more engaged. I become more internally motivated because I know that I'm doing stuff for me to better my life. And I'm also just more joyful. So who doesn't want that? I really like to use my friends um, essential oils in a variety of ways throughout my day to ritualize some various aspects of my day. And so I'd like to encourage you guys to use essential oils to create an aromatic shower. So at the beginning of the day or at the end of the day, when it's time to um, do your bathing ritual, you can use the scents of the oils to help you become more present. And an aromatic shower is like super easy to create. So even if you haven't used essential oils a whole lot or you're not really sure what to do, um, this is relatively simple. All you need to do is pick up some scents that you like. I recommend getting ones that are fairly inexpensive because they're essentially gonna eventually go down the drain in the shower. Um, but you'll use a lot of them. So, you know, don't use your rose, your frankincense for this sort of thing. Um, save those for putting it on your skin, you know. But something like rosemary, which is our oil of the month this month, or grapefruit or citruses like orange um, and eucalyptus is also really nice to use. But anything that you, that you like that really makes you feel uplifted, all you got to do is unscrew the cap. Uh, hopefully it's got a little orifice reducer in there so it doesn't all spill out and you're just going to place a couple drops on a washcloth oops see a lot they come out pretty quickly there a washcloth or a sponge ah you might even just inhale it before you put it in the shower and then just put it down in the shower turn on the hot water really nice and, and hot keep the washcloth towards the back of the shower not close to the drain and after a moment or two, you should have the whole shower fill up with this wonderful aroma of whatever scent that you chose. And then you go about your shower. But when I do that, then I'm more present to the experience of my shower. My mind's being woken up by the scents. And especially if I use the same scent several times, it's now become a ritual experience. My brain knows, oh, this is shower cleaning time. Let me mentally prepare myself for the rest of the day. So just these simple activities, actions that you can put in your daily tasks to make them more enjoyable and more of a ritual experience can really help you get out of the humdrum of the routine and into an upward spiral, if you will. Thank you for watching. I would love to know how you guys are incorporating simple rituals into your day and um, what oils you like to use for an aromatic shower. If you'd like to pick up any oils, we've got them here in the store. We're open Tuesday through Saturday. We also have a mail order. You can look at the online store at UpwardSpiralCenter.com. And thank you so much for letting me be a part of your day and your Upward Spiral.